Since 1966, there's been a small hot dog shop that's made the diners of Fall River fanatical. I'm Fanique about hot dogs. I'm Fanique about the Rolais. I'm Fanique about her homemade soups. Fanique is a, a loose translation of fanatic. We have several groups of people that come here religiously to get their hot dog fix. I'm Fanique about Fanique's. <laughs> and with just one bite, you too will be a fan of Fanique's. Chris and Liz Carpenter are the couple behind Phoenix, a quaint counter service spot decked out in historical shots of the South Coast. Here they offer the Coney Island Dog, a handheld phenomenon with a cult-like following in the area. Coney Island Hot Dog starts with a steamed bun and then we use an all-beef frank and it's topped with mustard, our special Coney Island sauce, and then a minced onion. It is delicious. Oh, it's an explosion in your mouth. You don't know where it's going. Is it going for the mustard? Is it going for the sauce? The cool of the onion, it's an experience. And ordering these delicious dogs is truly an art. So if you're at the register, you kind of have to be versed in the Coney Island talk because you'll get one customer that'll say, give me two with the works for here, and then the next customer will come in and say, I want two all the way in-house, which is exactly the same exact thing. It's both sauce, mustard, and onion for here. Or you'll get people that ask for the inside-out dog, which is the works underneath the hot dog. Some people will call that the mustache saver. Then you get people there ordering it to go, and they're saying, put wheels on it or uh, let it fly. It's almost like you're constantly learning the, the Coney Island language. In addition to the original, there are other tasty options like the Fanique Special Dog, loaded up with plenty of that local favorite chorizo, or this indulgent one piled with lots of cheese. It is like heaven in your mouth. You get the richness from the beef, you get the creaminess of the cheese and the spiciness of the sauce. Who wouldn't want that? In addition to hot dogs, Phoenix is also the home of the Rolle. A Rolle my wife invented. Everybody has a roll, you know what I mean? So we decided just to put one of those little lines on the top of the E and call it a Rolle. It's a egg roll wrapper with a variety of different fillings inside. You can have the chorizo, you can have a hamburg roll, or you can have the cheesecake roll. Egg. It is a whole piece of cheesecake, put it into the egg roll wrapper and we deep fry it so it's like a fried cheesecake. And then we'll top it with the cherries. When you bite into it, you get the savory from the egg roll wrapper, you get the sweetness from the cheesecake, and then you get the bitter from the cherries and it's, it's just delicious. Other favorites include clam cakes, chock full of fresh shucked meat, New England and Manhattan style clam chowders and a unique Fall River delicacy known as the chow mein sandwich. So chow mein sandwich is not your typical sandwich. You're not going to pick it up and eat it with your hands, especially the way we make it. You put the bun down and then we top it with chow mein noodles, which we get direct here from Fall River, and top it with our homemade hamburger. Then we put our thick gravy on, so it's just a heaping portion of chow mein with a bun. There's even a spin on this sandwich known as the Portuguese chow mein. The Portuguese chow mein, that is a phoenix thing. It is the chow mein sandwich, and then we top it off with chorizo. I really like the spicy and the savory together, and when you add the chorizo to the chow mein gravy, you're getting a nice savory, spicy mixture. Phoenix also offers all the comfort food faves you grew up on, from a sensational sloppy joe to a soul-satisfying bowl of American chopped suey. And since they're not far from the ocean, you can be sure the fish and chips are always fresh. Fresh like it was swimming like the day before you eat it. We get it locally right off the boat in New Bedford, and then we use a batter. It's a light beer batter with haddock. For a large, we get three large pieces, so it's just about three quarters of a pound. So our portions, I think, are unmatched in the city. And for the price, I don't think you can beat it. And more than that, you can't beat the feeling you get when you go to Phoenix. If you want to get a taste of Fall River, you should come to Phoenix. We have everything that Fall River could possibly offer you. We have the Charisse, we have the Chow Mein, we have the personality, um, we have the accents, and it's just nostalgic.